This is our Vegas 2024 match in February. We've got Tactical Sloth in this first round, starting in this trailer, simulate being in some sort of vehicle. You have to shoot left-handed, which is great for them since they are left-handed. Then you're supposed to shoot right-handed from here. You need to shoot. They uh, shoulder it on the right side, but don't actually switch to right-handed. I think it was ruled that since this was probably only a disadvantage, they didn't get yelled at for it. So, yeah, that happened. Of course, they're using a 9mm AR. It's a blowback unit. And doesn't tolerate being held super awkwardly not fully braced. It tends to malfunction when that happens, which of course, that's what happened. After yeah, getting that straightened out, they got those easily enough. Need to come down here, get each of those three targets again. Then there is a hostage taker target. If a high value shot on that, which they don't get. I think it looked like they got it, but it turns out they did not. I saw the hostage I saw the hostage taker move. Hitting the uh, hostage part of the hostage taker target called the hostage taker to move, <laughs> but they didn't actually get it. Right, Unfortunate. Six, six and then you just pop up here. You have two static steel to get hit on each of those, and then one plate from the Texas Star. And keep repeating until the Texas Star is done. And that was hitting that bottom plate, which makes it spin faster. Never super helpful. Keep going, keep going. It, it did it again. Reload. Need to reload. Keep going, keep going. Technique would be to shoot plate at the t near the top, nope. at the top of its arc. They're not doing that. They're aiming right at the very bottom where it's moving the fastest. Now, they get it down there, despite it being difficult. But it does take a minute. Drop the mag. I run through this. Now, I am not left-handed, and I am using the offset dot, which aiming, aiming left-handed with that, not so bad, but it does spit brass directly into my face, which was a, a little shot, unpleasant. So you just want to be real sure. Yeah, I got really awkward on my positioning there. Wasted a little bit of time with that. But then the targets were actually quite easy to hit after that. Then again, one hit on each from this third position. And then that hostage taker target. Bonus shot. Got it. All right, let's roll. Sling, come up there, and finish the pistol section. Again, with one hit on each static steel, and then a plate from Texas Star. And this month, my pistol's working. All been sorted out. Now, of course, my pistol accuracy is still something I'm working on. Static Steel, very easy. Texas Star, a bit of effort, though I do get it eventually. One more to hit, and I have to reload. There you go, 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 go. Round. This stage, that is a 150 pound dummy with a plate carrier with plates in it strapped to it. It's really.
really, really heavy. To drag it all the way up here, and then you have some pistol shooting. Any pass? A little more, a little more, a little more. Bomb. There you go. This, you start out strong hand only. Yeah, I know. One hit. Weak hand only. Also one hit. I read. And then two hands in the center, and then drop a popper. Popper. Alright. Again, strong, weak, two hands. And then you, after getting the second popper, drop the mag, take a clearing shot. It does not affect the score on this particular stage. You can hit it, miss it. It doesn't matter. It's just a way of making sure the gun is definitely clear before being reholstered. And then, drag the dummy back. This is, what, 30 yards of dummy dragging? Each way, so 60 yards total on that dummy. Still going. Still going. Brad's good. Load her up. And then there's rifle portion, which is more strong side and weak side. They're still using their KP9 based AR9. Right in the shoulder. So, strong side. Another hit the strong side. But it is actually two hits on each. They started to move on a little too quickly there. And then switch to weak side. Two hits. Two hits. Your right hand's right on top of that ejection port. Put it farther down. Drop the popper. And of course, you have to do the popper, the smaller target. Weak side. And once that last popper falls, Split. you're done. There you go. Yeah, they're still doing a left hand on it, oh. shooting off the right shoulder. Figure out the stand, yeah. Shake it, to the, shake it to the right. Which helped induce a malfunction. You're going to have to drop the mag. Yep. Yeah, we'll call it par. Okay, that's par. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Cool. I did. In, in here, then grab the dummy. Yep. You're ready. <coughs> Goodbye. Dummy drag. I have been working on my lifting a bunch recently. And this felt really slow, but doesn't look nearly as slow watching it after the fact. Oh, must have Strong side hit, all right. Weak side, yeah, man, I'm really, really not good at my left hand. This is still a struggle. did run for me today, and I'm getting through all this, I'm not super thrilled with my performance with Pistol. Um, that's an excuse, I could say I came into this arriving here very fatigued, and doing a bunch of dummy drags didn't help, and by the time I get to the last stage, I'm really feeling some deep fatigue, and it slowed me down, in particular, it's just hurting my pistol shooting a lot. Unsling the rifle. And get strong side. Two hits on each. Well, two hits on two targets. Strong side. Got 
confused there for a second and started to switch early and realized I still had another target to do. And then, weak side. You know, just looking at the way I'm standing, it just doesn't make sense to me mentally shooting the rifle left-handed. And I find everything about it awkward, and that's something I still need to work on a lot. I am chicken-winging a bit. Part of that is using that 45-degree offset dot, which works quite well, but I kind of naturally end up chicken-winging as I ro rotate the gun out. Now, left side, I'm shooting using the 3x prism because using the offset dot while shooting left-handed spits brass into my face. On this stage, the only target is a Texas star. But there was a twist. Every time you knock a plate down, table the pistol, pick up the 50-pound kettlebell, run it around and back, and then get your next plate. Not a particularly complicated stage, just a bit more physical activity. Keep your thumbs down. Just bleed on the gun. There you go. Now Tactical Soft is still struggling with very quickly going back to pistol and getting a correct grip. Fuck up your arms. Good job. That body mechanic stuff is something that they are working on. You got that. This is going on too long. Let it come to the gun, not the gun to the target. Come on. Any day now. They're definitely feeling some frustration. It does seem like after this last run, they really get back on it and get right into the correct headspace. Got this. Go, go, go. Hear that breath, that go. bit of focusing. Nice. Go, go, go. Let's and get taking this. that moment to focus. Wow. That grip on, did look terrible, but like it certainly appeared to work. That was great. There you go. One go, go, go. more. Getting refocused, getting right back in that headspace. And they're on it. Yeah. Nice. Woo. 11677. Good roll. And here I am doing it. I get a plate, carry the kettlebell, come back another plate. Cool. All right, shooter ready? Ready. Stand by. Still not doing amazing a pistol. All right, nice. But there is something I'm good at. Yeah, Brad. Nice. Yep. Careful. Good shot. Nice. So really, if anything, I think carrying that kettlebell around is helping me focus, and I'm doing better. Okay, I was doing better. Last one. Yes, yes, Terry, take a deep breath. Good shot. All right, drop mag. So clear. Stand by. Now this one included some choose your own adventure elements. If you so elected, you could start shooting back there. And if you got six hits in a row with no misses, you would have to drag that dummy half as far. No one at the match successfully did that. 
You had the option of not even trying. I was doing this at my very last days. Lots of people had already run it. I didn't even try. Capital Sloth wanted to try, but they missed their first one. And just moved on. The rest of it is just get hits on each of them, then a clearing shot, and then you go get your dummy. And this is just straight up pick up your rifle, sling it, drag the dummy 20 yards forward and 20 yards back. Now we're having fun! Fun! Clear all the targets. One hit on each static steel, knock down all the poppers. A little bit of struggle unhooking that from that water bladder on the back. There you go. And just just the fatigue. Getting, getting to everyone by this point of the day. I got it. Go ahead and finish it. Yeah, that popper didn't fall after getting hit multiple times. That's it. Unload. Show clear. I believe you. Yeah, I'm not even going to totally. attempt. You, no way I'm getting six hits at 50 yards of pistol without a single miss. No. I couldn't do that on a good day. At this point, I am extremely tired. So you're not doing the bonus? Not doing the bonus. All right, cool. You know the course fire. You know the course of fire. Should be ready. Ready. Bye. So here, 40 yards. One hit on each. Not the worst, but I get to even the closer spot. Up here at 30 yards, and I really start falling apart. Just kind of pumping rounds down range. Not taking the time to slow down and get my hits clearly. Just pulling it down to the left over and over again. Just because. Drop bag. Drop bag. Load one yeah, in. too much. Give it one shot. Drop oh, yeah. The clearing hop shot is supposed to be part of the sequence. I have to reload to take the clearing shot. Otherwise, you know, there you go. I would be unfair or something. I don't know. I felt really dumb jacking around in just to blast it into the berm to clear the gun. But Smart, oh well. leaving it in the front so it doesn't get caught. Now, when I was dragging this, it felt like I was taking forever and that I was struggling and moving slow. It doesn't look that slow watching this after the fact, though. But, tired. That's good. All right, you're good. All right, load it up, burn it down. But, made it through it. First match with my new rifle. Everything worked. Cool, drop your mag. So clear. Nice. Woo, cool. 